Eric Zarnix. Good morning, and thanks for joining us here on WLWT News 5. For us, things are starting off quiet, but anything but in North Carolina. Here's Hurricane Arthur, still a Category 2 storm with winds of around 100 miles an hour right around that central core. The good news is it's now moved back over the ocean, and it is going to move out to sea, possibly skirting Massachusetts late today and early tomorrow morning. Right now, the track, again, taking it off out into the ocean at a quick pace at northeast at 23 miles an hour. So the good news is this thing's Moving a little faster away from shore, and that'll be good news for North Carolina. For us, wow, what a beautiful start to the day. 57 degrees, our winds out of the north at 7 miles an hour, and our humidity sitting there at 69%. Dew points in the 40s. That's almost unheard of in the month of July. We're talking some very dry Canadian air that's built in, and it's going to hang around for much of the weekend. Temperatures elsewhere. 54 degrees Batavia, 52 Walton, 53 Dillsboro, 51 degrees in Oxford, 53 in Springboro, and 52 degrees in Versailles. Just a comfortable start for everybody. And again, high pressure, that's what's really dominating our weather here. In fact, that's what's pressed Arthur off the eastern seaboard and is going to continue its trek out to sea. For us, high pressure means clear skies, low humidity, plenty of sunshine, and cool mornings, but comfortable afternoons and that's what we're going to have pretty much all weekend long here. Highs today for us 78 degrees. I think we'll see 82 in St. Louis, 83 in Kansas. So much of the northern tier of the United States dealing with some very nice weather and as we head on into the weekend, things are going to stay pretty similar. Future cast showing clear skies today, not too much to talk about. Maybe a few clouds out around Akron and Columbus, but for us nothing here. And then as we head into the afternoon, staying sunny, staying nice this evening temperatures because of those clear skies will eventually drop back into the 60s and the 50s. So a light jacket if you're staying out late. And then your seven-day forecast, it's going to stay sunny and nice for the next couple of days, but warming up Monday and Tuesday. So for today, 78 degrees, sunny, dry, and comfortable. Those winds, well, a little breezy out there from time to time out of the northeast at about 5 to 15 miles an hour. Tonight down to 53 under those same clear skies. And tomorrow's forecast, just as easy as today's. Cool in the morning, sunny, comfortable in the afternoon, a high of 81. I think out of the three days of this holiday weekend, Sunday will be one of the warmer, up around 87 degrees. And then Monday and Tuesday, turning hot and humid.